Brothers and sisters, let us all receive today's word for meditation and declaration. It is from Luke chapter 11 verse 10. The word of God says, For everyone who asks receives, and everyone who searches finds, and for everyone who knocks the door will be opened. For everyone who asks receives, and everyone who searches finds, and for everyone who knocks the door will be opened. Thank you, Father. Praise you, Lord. Hallelujah. My dear brothers and sisters, let us all receive this word in this word today. The Lord speaks about persistence. The Lord speaks about perseverance in prayer. The Lord gives us the importance of a persistent prayer. Lipradu Sahada. God rewards uh, those who are persistent. Uh, just before this, he speaks about the parable of uh, the neighbor who persis persistently asked for the bread. Uh, see, the word of God says that our uh, God is generous. So it is not that you know our uh, God is not willing. A uh, God is generous and he answers your prayer. He gives what you ask. Uh, he is generous and his desire is to give you the good gifts. His desire is to give the best for his children. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Many a times we uh, fail to persevere, uh, to persist in our prayers. We fail to uh, continue to seek the Lord. Maybe because of our situation, maybe because of our pressures that we see around us, maybe because things are not um, the way that we expect it to be or maybe because you are not able to understand what is happening in your life and where you are right now. Maybe because of all these things, you tend to lose hope, you tend to give up, you tend to uh, have that low confidence, you tend to, um, you know, be troubled by the things that you see around you and uh, you uh, lose that focus, lose that connection or you lose, uh, you know, your waiting upon the Lord. Uh, being carried away by things that is around you but the word of god very clearly says first it says ask and you will receive seek and you will find knock and the door will be open and the lord very clearly says that everyone who asks receives it will surely happen if you ask you will receive if you knock the door will be open for you if you seek you will find what you are seeking first thing be persistent be persistent in your prayer don't give up just because something is not working out the way you want don't give up because something you know is uh, things that is happening is you're not able to understand what is happening don't give up because of the pressures that is around you don't give up on your prayer press on hold on and connect to the lord wait upon the lord know first this that you know your god is generous his desire is to answer your prayer and whatever be the prayers that you're lifting up to the Lord, make sure that your faith, your action is in line with your prayers. Make sure that you know the words that comes out of your mouth, not only in the time of prayer, but during the day. Amidst pressure, amidst uh, uh, different kinds of challenges that you confront. Amidst all of it, make sure that your you know you are aligned, your actions are aligned, your faith is aligned to that prayer of yours. Many a times we pray, yes, of course, but then later, after we come out of that prayer uh, room, prayer closet, we end up doing many things that minus our prayer. We end up speaking many things, we end up thinking many things, we end up imagining many things that cancels out our prayer. So let us not allow these things, let us be more conscious that our words, our thoughts, our actions, everything aligns with our prayer to the lord and be persistent let us choose to be persistent let us not give up let us not give up uh, recently we heard a talk of brother kevin where he was telling how uh, explaining to us how jesus 
persistently sat in the presence of God and he prayed. He prayed. He, he was explaining how, it, though it was just a one sentence prayer, for hours Jesus repeated the same prayer, waiting and pushing in the presence of God. Hallelujah. This is the kind of prayer that we have to do. Not just, you know, uh, doing something and then giving up saying, okay, I prayed so much and nothing is happening. Pray until you find. Pray until the door is open. Pray until you receive an answer. Hallelujah. Don't give up on your prayers halfway. Don't give up on your trust or on your faith halfway. Any time things will change. Any time, you know, your, your situation will change. Your things will be restored. So hold on to the Lord. For those who seek will find. Those who ask will receive. And those who knock, the door will be open for them, says the word of God. Let us receive this word and let us seek God's grace very specially that we may be persistent in our prayers, in our connection with the Lord. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I declare, I persevere in my prayer. My prayers are persistent. I persist in my prayer. I declare it in Jesus' mighty name. Lindosi Pratiba. My situation doesn't dictate my prayer life. In the name of Jesus Christ, I do not allow my situation. I do not allow my pressures. I do not allow the challenges around me to dictate my prayer life. In the name of Jesus Christ, no matter what be the things that is happening around me, no matter what be the challenges, no matter what be the situation or the pressure that is seen around me, I persist in seeking my God, believing that my God God is a generous God. He gives, He answers. He is delighted to answer my prayer. He is delighted to give me throto sanda, the best gifts, the good gifts. In the name of Jesus Christ, therefore I persist. I persist. I do not yield to the pressures. I do not yield to the negative things that is happening around me. I do not yield to the challenges or the things that is confronting me. I do not yield to it. But I wait upon the Lord. I choose to persist in my prayers, holding on to the Lord, trusting the Lord. For I believe my God who has promised is faithful to fulfill whatever he has promised in my life. I hold on to the Lord. I hold on to the promise of the Lord. I hold on to the word of the Lord. For my God who has promised will fulfill in my life in the name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus. Jesus Christ. I seek the Lord according to his word. The word of God says everyone who asks receives. In the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever I ask in the name of Jesus Christ according to his will I will receive it in Jesus mighty name. There will be no delay for my prayers. In the name of Jesus Christ my prayers will be answered. I declare it in Jesus name all the lies and deceptions of the enemy. I rebuke it. All the hopeless feelings, all the discouragement and disappointment of the enemy. I rebuke it and I command it out of my life. In the name of Jesus Christ, my God is a generous God. My God is a God who hears my prayer. My God is a God who answers me from his holy heaven. Therefore, I declare I will receive what I am seeking for. I will find what I am seeking for. I will receive what I ask for. And I will uh, the doors will open for me every door that i knock on will open for me i declare it in jesus mighty name traba satula alpene bradina sangas pala legal palpotra tsi i declare in the name of jesus christ my god hears my prayers my god hears my prayers every prayer of mine is heard by my god my god hears my prayer and my god answers my request i declare it in jesus mighty name i believe that my god is a generous father and he delights in blessing me he delights in answering me he delights in providing for me i declare it in jesus mighty name all the lies of the enemy all that bitterness all the uh, all the doubt that the enemy has put inside of me i rebuke it i command it out of me in the name of jesus christ lepra tuyo sanda i declare that i will receive what i ask for in faith in the name of Jesus Christ, I believe 
believe that God's promises are true. Ilabra sundala dehebai. I rely on God's promises. Lidara sontra abra diba sihito. I declare I am the child of God and my God delights in answering my prayers. Lipro doba sandra hadi. E kroda masiande. E baldere ba. As I wait upon the Lord, pressing on for my answers, I continue to wait upon the Lord by faith. I continue to wait upon the Lord, believing and trusting that His timing is perfect, believing and trusting that at the right time He will release my answer. In the name of Jesus Christ, I will persist in prayer until I receive an answer. I will not give up, no matter what be the pressures or the lie or the deceptions of the enemy. I will not give up on my prayer. I will not give up my seeking. I will not give up me holding on to the Lord. I persist in prayer in the name of Jesus Christ. I declare God's grace is sufficient for me. As I seek the kingdom of God, I believe and I declare all these things will be added unto me in Jesus' mighty name. I declare I will seek God with all my heart, with all my soul, with all my mind. And whatever that I am seeking God, I will find what I am looking for. I declare it in the name of Jesus Christ. Every door that I knock on will open for me in Jesus' mighty name. As I persistently knock at the doors of blessings breakthrough restoration I declare in the name of Jesus Christ every door that I knock on will open for me in the name of Jesus Christ the doors of restoration the door of healing the door of deliverance the door of blessing will open for me in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ my God will open the doors of blessings for me. I align myself to the word of God. I align myself to the plans of God. I align myself. I align myself to the Lord, to his perfect will, to his perfect plan. Every desire of mine is according to God's will. Therefore, I declare that every prayer of my will be heard it will be answered in Jesus mighty name my God is working all things together for my good I declare it in the name of Jesus Christ though I don't understand the plans of God though I don't understand what is happening in my life I choose to trust in my God I choose to trust in his ways I choose to trust in the Lord in the name of Jesus Christ all of God's promises are for me and and I claim it and I receive it in Jesus' mighty name. By faith, uh, I knock on every door, every promise. It will be released for me. It is mine. I declare it in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, I am a recipient uh, of God's abundant grace and mercy. I believe like as the word of God says, uh, my God will provide for all my needs uh, according to his riches and glory. I declare I will see a financial breakthrough. I declare I will see a mighty restoration in every areas of my life. I declare in the name of Jesus Christ there will be abundance in every areas of my life. I declare I will be the head and not the tail. I declare I will see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. I declare in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever be the doors that the Lord has opened for me. No man can shut it in the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord's hand is upon my life. Therefore, I prosper in all that I do. In the name of Jesus Christ, every prayer of mine is heard. Whatever I ask, I receive. Whatever I seek, I find. What, 
ever be the door that I knock on, it opens for me in the name of Jesus Christ. Krito lobas tiapara, pradembra adla grace doctora ampradima. In the mighty name of Lord Jesus Christ, I declare, what I ask, I receive. What I seek, I find. And whatever be the door that I knock, it opens for me. I declare it in Jesus' name. I walk in the authority of the name of Jesus Christ. I am a child of God. Le prodia sanda. At the right time, the right blessings are released and manifested in my life. I declare it in Jesus' mighty name. The plan of the enemy will not succeed. Le prodia sanda. The weapons that uh, operates against me or comes against me will not prosper. The weapons that fashions against me will not prosper. In the name of Jesus Christ, I ask in the name of Jesus Christ and I receive I seek persistently and I find I knock trusting in the Lord trusting and holding on to the promise of the Lord and the door opens for me I declare it in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ Sunday. no matter what be my situation I declare I choose to persist in my prayer my words my thoughts my actions I align it with my prayer I align it with my faith I align it according to the word of God and therefore I receive and I am established I am blessed in the name of Jesus Christ I declare it Prate Satlo Om Pradiva Sandra Hola. I declare it in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. I declare it in Jesus' name. I declare it in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Praise you, Father. Thank you, Father. Bless your holy name. Thank you, Father. Praise you, Lord. No matter what be the plan or the schemes of the enemy. Thank you, Lord, that you have given us the grace that we may press on you. Thank you, Lord, that you have given us the grace that we may pers persist in our prayers. We praise and thank you, Father, that we receive what we ask because we ask it according to your will, Father. We thank you for your Holy Spirit who is continuously working in our life. We praise and thank you for your goodness is surely revealed in all our lives. We praise and thank you, Father. We bless your holy name. We adore you. We worship you, Lord. We thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Gracious and loving Father, we thank you, Lord, for this wonderful time in your presence. As we all go ahead today, we thank you, Father, that you are with us. You are giving us the grace, the anointing, the power, the faith that is needed for us to persist in our prayers. We thank you, Lord, that we all are victorious in every prayer that we have lifted up to you. In the name of Jesus Christ, thank you, Father, for your goodness and your mercy.